everybody welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a, an ipsy unboxing i have two ipsy boxes that i have yet to unbox with you guys last month's and this month's which actually came in a box so i don't have my tripod set up i don't have anything this is going to be an informal video but they're going to try to i'm going to try to make them quick so i'm going to dump out last month's box and there's stuff stuck i'm trying to go to bed soon so i didn't want to like get everything out so last month was celebrate you so that was march march's box and this was the bag it's a cute little it says unstoppable it's a cute little bag it came with the Yensa Super 8 Lip Oil. This is awesome. I tried it uh, last month. Not last month. I tried it last week. Sorry. I said last month and I didn't mean to. I tried it last week. And I really liked it. It's um, very moisturizing on the lips. And not to mention the color is also really pretty unique um let's see how much this retails for 24 dollars. so i get the um lux edition because to me for 27 dollars, why not i got this luna liner it's water resistant liquid eyeliner it's got a felt tip on it this was 18 dollars msrp so that was cool. Also, it came with this really nice brush. Now, I have been waiting and waiting to make a video so I could use this brush. It's going to be perfect for under eye concealer and stuff like that. It's by the brand Complex Culture. And this brush was pretty expensive. It says on here that it was $26. For a precision concealer brush. Then I got this Hemp's Sweet Pineapple and Honey Melon uh, Lotion. I love getting these. Um, I take them to work. I put them in my purse. I put them in my book bag. I love having something for moisture. Because my hands and especially right here on my forehead has been getting extremely, extremely dry. So I love having some kind of body lotion or something that's sensitive to the skin, all natural stuff like that. This MSRP is $10.59, so that's pretty expensive. And the last couple things, this is the Hey Honey Trick and Treat Concealer, and this is in light to medium. I'm excited to try that. I've been into trying new concealers and stuff. This MSRP is $36. The last thing is this Auto Balm, the Balm Day to Night Shadows on the Go palette. This thing is so hard to open. Um, it takes me like, no lie, like 10 minutes to get this thing open. It is the only thing I hate about this hang on and i will get it open for you okay so i got it open and it's got a mirror so I'm... i got it open so it's got a mirror i don't know what i've showed you i'm just gonna try not to show you the mirror but it looks like this um i really like it it's got really nice neutral colors in it and you can also once you're done pop out this right here and it let me show you Sorry, this is a really not formal video. You probably are like, what the heck is she doing? But you can just pop it out and it's an empty tin. You can use it for pretty much anything. So I do like this. Um, for me, that box was totally worth it. Um, alone, just for the palette, was $26.50. So... The March box was an overall win. So, for this month's box, it's called the Full Bloom Box. 
and I'm pretty excited about this one. It's got a lot of nice things in it. Um, so let's dig right on in. The first thing I'll show you is the bag. I'm not a big fan of the bag, but we'll make it work. It's got like a, this right here. If my ferrets see this, it'll be destroyed because it's wood. Or if my dog gets a hold of it, moves. But it's just a little zip around and it fully zips, which is nice. Um, so the bag, you get two uh, Star Skin VIP skin masks. Um, these all were $30. Oh my gosh, $30 for these. And they're little pore masks. We might, if you guys want to review on these, we might be able to do that. This one is, let's see what the difference is. This one is recovering, instantly recovering luxury uh, cream coating face mask. And this one is the illuminating face mask. So, there's those. Next, we have the TARDIS Dual End. This is a sorry this is the liner duo you've got a brush tip on one side and the pencil liner on the other just the normal pencil this is quite expensive as well it's 24 dollars for that um yes very expensive then we have a triple shot extra extra large mascara by ciate ciate is a pretty reasonably priced brand for some things but this mascara is 22 dollars the next thing that I have is the Levito Inspired Purifying Face Mask and Exfoliator. Uh, comes in a box like this. When you open it up, it's just a little bottle. But um, for face pills and stuff like that, you don't want to use them every day. So that's okay. It looks like this. You get how many fluid ounces? It doesn't say on here. It doesn't say. It might say it on the box. 50 mils. So 1.69 fluid ounce. And that retails for $36. That's pretty expensive. The last thing we have on here is a palette. And it is a... Let me get it out of here. Trying to use, it's really hard to use one hand. Next time, no matter how late it is, I'm going to get my tripod. So, this is the Miami um, Shana B Miami Eyeshadow Palette. And it's really cute. I love the colors in here. Look how cute. All neutral colors, shimmers, and then mattes. Um, we can do a look with this for sure one day, but that is, let's see, $20. Great two boxes. I really enjoy getting my Ipsy's um, and BoxyCharm, so that will be coming up next whenever I get it in the mail. If you guys did like, please give me a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, hit that post notification bell. That way you get notified every time I upload a new video, and until next time... Stay cool and be you. Bye.